Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how to make your own custom flower arrangements. Here you can see I have different flowers. Each one of these was $3.98. Today they had them at HEV. So I'm going to show you step by step how to do it. You know, flower arrangements can range between $20, $30, $40, and they go all the way up to $100. Man, who knows what? But I actually make mine custom made. So any of my friends who receive flower arrangements will actually know that I actually made them. I pick out the flowers, the cutters, which ones I want to combine. I get a cute little container that I already have here at home, and then I give it out. So I know my mom's gonna love it, and I'm gonna show you here step by step how to do it. So you're going to need scissors, you're gonna need your vase, so I got a clear one, and then a green one, and your flowers. Each one of these comes in a little plastic bag, so you need to cut them off, take out the little uh, food, and put your flowers like this so you know the colors you have the variety the different styles and also how you want to arrange them. so i cut off the leaves first and then you can measure how high or how tall you want your flowers to be in the base. For example, I put it right next to the base. As you can see, this is too long. So I'm gonna cut a little bit off to see where it is. A little bit more. And I think that'll be the perfect size. So then I put it inside and I can remove that. So you get a flower and then you measure it against the base that you're going to use to see the height. Now, as you can see, this one is smaller than these. These are the tallest ones I have. These are shorter and then this one is tall also. So you have a variety of sizes um, and then you just go in and see where the holes are at. So I could technically add one here.
This is the flower arrangement that I have. I put orange, white, purple, and some peach, and some more white. My mom loves these, so I decided to buy them, and this is how the flower arrangement looks. If you want, you can make it more full. Technically, I could put one here to make it look more full. It depends how full you want. I don't want it to be that full because I want it to be where my mom can pick it up and just cut off the stems and put new water on it. So this is her first vase that I have for her birthday. Ahorita le voy a hacer el segundo, como pueden ver, ya hice el primero para mi mamá. Esto. Le decidí hacer morado, naranja, como coral y blancas para hacerle un poquito de balance y los balones también son morados. Así que esos son los colores que le voy a hacer para este año. Y como pueden ver, está un poquito llenito. Eh, lo pueden hacer tan lleno ustedes quieran, pero yo lo quiero hacer para que ella pueda nada más levantar las flores para cambiarles el agua cada 3-5 días y cortarles abajo así que este es el primer flower arrangement que le tengo y ahorita le voy a hacer el segundo así que tengo mi base volvemos a hacer lo mismo agarramos la flor la pones a la par para ver qué tan alto lo quieres ejemplo aquí está lo quiero un poquito más chiquito y ahí está yo les dejo este plástico a estas porque como estas crecen para arriba, me gusta eh, que se queden rectas, pero tú se lo puedes quitar como tú quieras. Le quito todas las hojas y lo vuelvo a medir. So let me, so let me show you, this is vase number one. And these smell really good and these, and my mom loves these. And then this is vase number two. I could have put them in vase one, but technically this looks like that. So, technically it's that three, six, nine, twelve, three. $15 and I got two vases out of it. So don't forget that you don't always, you can make your own custom arrangement. All you have to do is measure, get a vase, buy the flowers, pick your colors, measure, cut them, and just place them however you like. And the person
person you give them to, well, love.